Okay, in this video, I'd like to showcase some of the capabilities as far as high velocity welding. Now, where would you use this type of technique? Well, you would use this technique on very, very thin material. So right here, I have a stainless steel assembly. It's got a 120 thou thick piece of stainless steel there, but it's welding to a 400 micron thick piece of aluminum here on the T-joint. Now, that is very thin, okay? I can't just linger on my weld when I'm, uh, when I'm about to do that interior seam right there. I have to move quickly at a higher power so that there's not gonna be any deformation on this part. Let me show you what I'm talking about. I already did some tacks to make sure we're all set up. I'm gonna drop my visor. And away we go. Okay, we're gonna turn it over and do the same thing. All right, excellent. Now look at what we have there. We have a full penetration weld going to the other side, nice and shiny because of our shield gas, and we double-sided it. This looks really good. Now, as you can tell, I'm gonna give you a straight on view here, it did not deform the 400 micron thick piece of stainless steel. Now, just to show you that this isn't just mildly tacked on there and this isn't video tricks, I'm gonna do a little deformation test here to see if this weld breaks, okay? So we got both sides, and I'm just gonna push it down as so, and we'll see where this 400 micron part bends. And as you can tell, there's no breakage. That is a solid weld that goes all the way through, probably two millimeters deep with uh, a power setting I had right there. Let's check the profile. And as you can tell, there was no breakage on the end either. This part only bent after the weld. This is looking really good. And that's how you do a high velocity weld with the Light Weld 1500. I hope this video was informative and thanks for watching. To learn more about the Light Weld 1500, please click the link on the description below.